Hey everybody, thought I'd make a video of this VFR 6th Gen Interceptor. It's been a little bit of a project of ours. Been working on it for some time and wanting to restore one. Finally came upon one in Florida. Had 4,800 original miles on it, so pretty excited about refreshing and upgrading it. Thought I'd walk you around and tell you all the stuff we've done. Um, starting from the back, you can see we've done the Delkovic full system exhaust system. Um, we've also changed the rear turn signals and the front signals to clear, which is a later year in the uh, VFR line. Um, really, really looks good on silver. Um, continuing on, we put a sergeant seat on it. We've got a 520 kit that we put with uh, stock gearing. You can see the blue spring under there. We put a Penske uh, remote reservoir adjustable shock. Um, moving on, uh, when we bought the bike, the uh, lower fairing had some kind of a, I'm going to say some kind, some kind of a custom paint scheme. So we had to have that and the nose cone uh, repainted, which really turned out well from the color match. Moving forward, you can see we put uh, hella bars on it, uh, Oxford heated grips, uh, Vortex shorty levers, uh, double bubble zero gravity windscreen. Um, let's see, kind of running out of things. Oh, one of the other things that we're really glad that we did was we put the uh, braided stainless steel lines on all on all cables, so clutch, brakes, uh, whole nine yards. It's a black stainless, which really really turned out well. You can kind of see if I zoom in here so you can see that the fittings are really nice and it's really clean um, and that's about it guys I've started up just so you can hear kind of what the Delkovic stand sounds like um, and <laughs> let me just say uh, not selling this is what people should do to a 18 year old VFR interceptor but for us it's always been a bike we've been pretty passionate about so just kind of wanted to share what we did a second I'll just start it up oh that's not being neutral videos is you never know if these things sound any good. Hopefully it turns out all right. So yeah, we've got the, sounds like we've got the DB killers in there. We might pull those out. It's a little bit quiet, but all in all, not too bad. We're pretty happy with it. So if you have any questions on parts and stuff, we probably missed a few things that we did, but uh, if you have any questions on what it took to get it done, uh, just let us know. Thanks.